Super Max, the boy who couldn't fly. Once upon a time, in the small town of Doodleburg, there lived an ordinary boy named Max. Well, ordinary except for one thing, Max was convinced he had superpowers. He just hadn't quite figured them out yet. One day, while eating breakfast, Max declared, Mom, I'm sure I have super strength. He tried to lift the fridge. It didn't budge an inch, but the cereal box on top fell on his head. Max blinked, grabbed a handful of cereal, and grinned. That was just a warm-up. At school, Max decided it was time to reveal his true identity. During recess, he tied a towel around his neck, put on his dad's sunglasses, and climbed onto the tallest jungle gym. I'm Super Max, he shouted. The other kids looked up, confused. To prove his powers, Max pointed to the sandbox where his friend Billy was building a sandcastle. Max had watched enough superhero movies to know that sand was like quicksand if you looked at it the right way. Don't worry, Billy. I'll save you from the evil sand pit. Before Billy could react, Max dove dramatically toward the sandbox. Unfortunately, Super Max forgot one important thing, gravity. With a less-than-heroic goof, he landed face-first in the sand. His cape fluttered to the ground behind him. Billy blinked. Ah, uh, thanks. Covered in sand, Max dusted himself off. No problem. It was all part of my super plan. That night, Max was ready for his next mission. He had decided his superpower must be super speed. He put on his pajamas and zoomed through the house, pretending to outrun invisible villains. In his excitement, he zipped straight into the living room and knocked over a lamp. Max's dad sighed. Super Max, huh? Max gave his dad a sheepish grin. Even superheroes make mistakes. As his parents tucked him into bed, Max whispered, Maybe tomorrow I'll fly. And so... Every day, Max tried out a new superpower. Even though none of them quite worked as planned, Max was sure of one thing, he was definitely the superhero his town didn't know it needed. But just in case, he kept his towel cape ready for the next big adventure.